Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we'll be doing part 7 of my Christmas series, The Robin. You will need white yarn, orange yarn and gold yarn, or gold sparkle yarn. And light brown yarn and dark brown yarn. You will need a 6cm poly ball, a 4cm poly ball, a stitch marker, 4mm safety eyes, a pair of scissors, sewing needle, cocktail stick and a 4mm crochet hook. So let's get started. In orange yarn, we'll do six single crochets into a magic ring. Now two single crochets in each stitch. So now we'll do two single crochets in the next stitch and then a single crochet and we're going to do that six times all the way around. So we're going to do single crochets in each stitch for the next four rows. And so I'll meet you back here when you're done. So now we'll do two single crochets in the next stitch. And then one more single crochet and we'll do that nine times all the way around. So now for the next seven rows, we're going to single crochet in each stitch. And I'll meet you back here when that's all done. Okay, we're now going to get our four centimeter poly ball. I'm just gonna snip part of the end off. You can do it with scissors or a knife, whichever's easiest for you. Okay, we need to connect those together, so with the cocktail stick, we're going to snap that in half. And in the 6cm poly ball, we'll just push those in close together. And then just pop that on top, like so. So now, going back to our work, we're going to insert the eyes somewhere between row 4 and row 5. Okay, now we're just going to push those eyes into the poly ball to secure our work. We're now going to do a slip knot. Then we're going to chain 2 and then we're going to single crochet in the second chain from the hook. And now we'll tie off. And then we've made our beak. And we'll just sew that just below the eyes, like so. Okay, so before we continue, we want to change to white yarn. So we'll take our stitch out and then we're going to 
pull through the white yarn. Okay, and once that's done, we'll continue and single crochet two together. And then single crochet in the next seven. And we'll do this th two more times, so three times in total. Okay, we're now going to single crochet two together and then single crochet in the next two and we'll do this six times going to single crochet two together and then single crochet in the next four do that three times Now we're going to single crochet two together and then single crochet in the next stitch and we'll do that five times. Okay, we're now going to single crochet together five more times. And once that's done, we will tie off and then just sew in the ends. So now in the light brown yarn, we're going to Put six single crochets into a magic ring. Now we're going to do two single crochets in each stitch. I'm going to do two single crochets on the next stitch. And then single crochet in the next. And we'll do that and then we'll do that six times.
Okay, so now we're going to turn our work and chain one, and then we're going to single crochet in the next two stitches. And then we're going to tie off. So this will be the top part of the head and we're just going to join on for the rest of the work. So if we do a slip knot we're going to count one, two, three. So in that third stitch from the little protruding part we'll join on there and then we'll single crochet in the next 12 stitches. Okay, and then we're going to chain one and turn our work. Okay, we're going to half double crochet in the next 12 stitches. And now chain one and turn our work. Now we're going to double crochet in the next 12. Okay, and now we're going to chain one, turn our work. Now we're going to do two single crochets in the next stitch. And then a single crochet in the next 10. And now we're going to do two single crochets in that last stitch. Oops. And now we're going to chain one, turn our work, and half double crochet in the next 14. So there's a pattern forming. We're going to do single crochets, half double crochets, double crochets. Okay, going to chain one, turn our work, and then we're going to double crochet in the next 14. Now we're going to chain one and turn our work. So now we're going to do two single crochets in the next stitch. And then we're going to single crochet in the next three. Now we're going to 
going to do two single crochets in the next stitch, single crochet in the next four, two single crochets in the next stitch, single crochet in the next three, two single crochets in the next stitch and then we'll chain one and turn our work. Now we're going to half double crochet in the next 18. And we're going to chain one, turn our work. We're now going to double crochet in the next 18. Going to chain one, turn our work. So now we're going to single crochet three together and then pull through all. And we're going to single crochet in the next three, and two single crochets in the next stitch, single crochet in the next four. two single crochets in the next stitch, single crochet in the next three, and then single crochet three together. Now we're going to chain one and turn our work. Now we're going to half double crochet three together. We pull through all those loops and then we'll half double crochet in the next 10. Okay, now we're going to half double crochet three together. Pull through all of those loops on the hook. Okay, we're going to chain one and turn our work. Now we're going to double crochet three together. We're going to double crochet in the next six. Okay, now we're going to double crochet three together. Okay, and now we're going to chain one and turn our work. Okay, so now we're going to do the tail feathers. So single crochet in the next stitch. Then we're going to chain four. 
and we're going to double crochet in the second chain from the hook. And then we're going to double crochet in the next two. And then we're going to single crochet back into that initial row. Okay, and now let's do that four times. So we'll go single crochet in the next stitch, chain four. Uh, double crochet into the second chain from the hook, double crochet in the next two, and then single crochet back into that row. And we'll do that two more times. Okay, now we're just going to slip stitch all the way round, avoiding the tail feathers. So all the way up the side, all at the top of the head, and back down the other side. Now do that last slip stitch and we'll tie off. Leave a long piece of yarn because we're going to use that now to sew the piece to the main body. Make sure that little protruding part is just above the eyes. And once the head is sewed on then you can focus on the body Make sure you pull the sides round a bit as well so you can see them and leave the tail feathers free. Okay. We don't want to sew the tail feathers down. Okay. So now for the wings, we're going to slip knot in the dark brown yarn. I'm going to chain six. Going to single crochet in the second chain from the hook. And then we're going to single crochet in the next stitch. Half double crochet in the next two. Now we're going to do five double crochets in this last stitch. And that's going to inevitably turn your work around. So then we can sew up the other side of the chain. Okay, the last double crochet. Now we're going to half double crochet in the next two stitches. Going to single crochet in the next two. Now going to chain three, single crochet in the second chain from the hook, and now we're going to go back and single crochet into the next two. 
come back down the side again so half double crochet in the next two and now we're going to do two double crochets in the next five Half double crochet in the next two stitches, single crochet in the next stitch, and we'll slip stitch here, and then we'll just tie off. So we're going to make two of these, and then we'll just sew them just overhanging the brown back and onto the red breast, like so. And there you have your sweet little Christmas Robin. If you like this tutorial, there are many more to come. Hit the like and subscribe buttons to be notified when the next tutorial is released. And follow me on Instagram at Karina Jane Crochet to see more of my up and coming projects. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.